Hi! So now, we will unbox the Reboot STEM Education Robot Kit. So as you can see here, we have two different boxes. So the first one is the utility box. And then the other one is the simple box for Reboot Gym. Now, maybe you're asking, why do we have two different boxes here? So the first reason on the utility box, for example, if you want to join a competition, it's more convenient to bring than this one. But before unboxing it, first we need to know what Weboot Education Robot Kit is. So Weboot Education STEM Robot Kit, also known as the Weboot Jeep, it is the advanced form of Weboot Mini that comes with everything you need to build a line follower or Jeep robot. It has a drag and drop visual programming interface. Also, it can be programmed using a smartphone app or IR remote control. So now, let's take a look what's inside this box. So now, we will unbox the Weboot Jeep. So as you can see here, it shows the build form of Weboot Jeep. And on the upper left corner of this box, you can see the logo of WeMate. And on its left side, you can see the different forms of Weboot Jeep. And on the right side, you can see its specifications. And lastly, we have the bottom part of the Weboot Jeep. So, it shows the exploded view of the Weboot Jeep. So, now, let's take a look what's inside this box. So, first... We have here the microcontroller port. So, it is attached on its port. So, the only function of this one is to process and to receive an information. Okay, next we have the wheels with tires. The third one we have the beams. So, we have different beams here. Okay. Next, we have the RGB ultrasonic sensor. Okay. Next, we have the battery holder. And its batteries. Okay. Next, black electrical tape next we have the LED matrix panel so you can attach it on the robot next we have some screws nuts wrench and hex key here and also the caster wheel Next, we have the manuals. So, as you can see here, the manuals, we have two different manuals here. So, the first manual is for the robot if you want to build. So, it has a different instruction right here. And then, the other manual is for, for attaching the other motors of the robot. Next, we have the line following map okay so it's more big than the we bought mini line tracing map next we have the panels for both sides of the robot so right and left side next we have the line follower sensor so it is a double line follower sensor so, it's different from the line follower sensor of the Weboot Mini because it's just a single line follower. Next, we have the charger of the battery. So, it is a USB cable type charger. Next, we have the cables. So, we have a, a cable for the sensors and a power cable. Next, the USB cable 
Next is the remote control. Next is the motors. So we have two motors here with gears. And then lastly, we have the screwdrivers. So that's all. Thank you. So after unboxing this one, we will now unbox the utility box of the WeBot Jeep. So first, we have the we have the microcontroller board that attaches on its board. Next, we have the beams. So we have four beams here. Okay. Next, we have the black electrical tape. The fourth one, we have the RGB ultrasonic sensor. Okay. Next, some tools like screws, nuts, wrench. Next, we have the LED matrix panel that you can attach on the robot. Next is the battery holder and its batteries. Okay. Next, it's wheels with tires. Next, we have the line follower sensor. Again, it is a double line follower sensor unlike the single line follower sensor. Okay, next, we have the motors. Two motors. And then the panels for both sides of the robot, right and left. And then next, we have the cables. So cable for sensors if you want to attach some sensors. And then the cable as the power cable. Next, the USB cable. Okay. And then the next one, we have the screwdrivers. Next stuff, we have here the... manual for attaching the motors of the robot. Next, we have the line following map. So, it's different from the line following map of the WeBot Mini. Next, we have the remote control. Next is the manual if you want to build the WeBot Jeep. And then, another tire. So, a total of four, four wheels with tires. And the last one, we have the charger of your battery. So, and as you can see here, it has a lot of spaces. That's the purpose of utility box. So, that's all. Thank you. We see the next video. So, we're done! Finally, we saw what's inside these two boxes and I hope you like it. And for further information or if you want to know more about this WeBot Jeep, please see our next video. And that's all. Thank you!